couple days ago, I posted that I found a couple of the little red cherry shrimp in this tank that probably stowed away on some Christmas moss. So I thought, you know, I'm cleaning out my tank in the house, the 16 gallon water box tank I have that's got, I don't know, a bunch of cherry shrimp in it, little babies. Uh, I heard, uh, it was a Girl Talks fish, how they uh, breed like cockroaches and they do, oh my gosh. So anyway, I'm gonna introduce five more in there. I don't know if we can see them. Let me see if I can block the glare. Yeah, that's a lousy picture. And I'm doing the uh, drip acclimation thing. Hopefully that'll help me be a little successful. And then I'm gonna try real hard. Let me adjust the drip just a hair down more so it's not, because the idea is just to, to drip and let it, let it go pretty slow. So they acclimate. Water's pretty much all the same from here to here. And I'm gonna have to pour them in at, at one end of the tank because I'm not looking to feed these guys. That is not, I like shrimp, but you know, I, I don't want them to be eating the shrimp, so. Anyway, I'll post this and uh, we'll see how it works out. And then maybe there will be seven shrimp in this tank when it's all said and done. I've only seen one of the two uh, the last couple times I looked. That first time I saw two of them side by side. So we shall see how it works out. I started out with about a cup of water and then I dripped them up to about three cups. So I added about two cups out of this tank. So that's about a two to one. And I am gonna just pour them in now. And the crebensis are at the other end of the tank because they're the big fish in this pond. So I'm gonna hope that these little guys will be okie doke. We'll hope for the best. There goes one. There's five of them in here. Yeah, I know they don't wanna give up. Here comes one. And they're all out, and I couldn't tell you where they went, but they did. Not a clue. But the joys of fish keeping and shrimp keeping. So they're around here somewhere. So hopefully they will get happy. And earlier today, because of the other two that were in here, I put some of this Bacter AE in. And I'm sure this tank's like shrimp friendly anyway. It's pretty well established, so there's probably a lot of uh, bio slime on everything, all the wood, the plants. There's lots of little uh, microorganisms. And oh, look at the little baby crevences. I did a post earlier on that. You can really see how they've separated out. There's some that look like the species that they're gonna be the darker ones. And a lot of the little albino ones. So it's a good mix, it's kind of cool. But look at them all. This is great. And these guys, Bob and Carol, are phenomenal parents. So more will be revealed.